Hi everyone, welcome or welcome back to the Nated Engineering Corner. On today's video, we'll be doing curves of interpenetration for two cylinder pipes. So please like, comment, and subscribe to the channel for more videos. As you can see here, I have already redrawn the two given views. We have our front view, we also have our top view. And we have two circles that we're going to use to project our construction lines that are going to form the curve. The first circle is going to project construction lines to the front view. And the second circle is going to project construction lines to the top view. So the first thing we're going to do, we're going to divide our circles, the circles that are going to project construction lines, into six equal parts. And we're going to number these parts. Now, we are going to number the circle for the front view clockwise, meaning our numbering is going to move clockwise from 1 to 12. After this, we're going to number the circle for, for the top view anti-clockwise, meaning our numbering is going to move anti-clockwise. So our 1 is going to be at the center line, moving anti-clockwise until we reach 12. We number the circle for the top view anti-clockwise because we are given these views in third angle orthographic projection. Meaning in third angle orthographic projection, your numbering will move anti-clockwise. Now we are just going to project these lines onto the front view. Now you're going to project the lines on the top view and your line of projection should stop at the circumference of the circle on the top view. Now you're just going to project the lines on the circumference of the circle of the top view downwards. So you're going to make a point with the construction line of one on the front view and the construction line of one on the top view meet and then you're going to you're also going to do this for the construction line of two on the front view and the construction line of two on the top view you're going to make a point and you're going to continue like this until you cover all the numbers
now you're just going to join all these points using your flexi curve and then you're done you have your curve of interpenetration on the front view So this is the final product. Please like, comment and subscribe to the channel for more videos. Also, please share the video with your friend or anyone you know this video might help. Also, please tell us what you think in the comment section. And thank you for watching.